Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a video on this Kate Spade transformation that I did for a planner. Um, as most of you know who follow me on my Instagram page, I use the Kate Spade um, Wellesley planner. It's a personal size planner with rings that I use as my planner. This is just my little grocery list. So you all have seen how I use this, how I put this together and everything. I use the, um, this insert is by Agenda 52. It can be found at Michael's. It has some great little dashboards. This is actually my May, um, getting ready for the next month for May. Um, but I'll just do, this is how I kind of have set up my spread um, for the things just prepping for May. But here's just a flip, a quick little flip through of some of the spreads that I have done. That week I didn't do anything. Sometimes it happens, you know. Just a couple of little spreads that I've done um, in this particular uh, in this particular planner, but that's not today's video. Today's video is um, if you can't get your hands on this, because this is out of stock. Like I've actually found this on a website called Poshmark. I did pay about 80 bucks for it, but I know that they were being found at um, the outlet, Kate Spet outlet. So if you have an outlet close by you, you can um, definitely call them and see if they have it, see if they'll send it to you or go on Poshmark, go on eBay, um, and see if someone who has one they're not using anymore, will sell it to you. You can make an offer. Um, but yeah, I paid, I think $80 for that pink one, but you can purchase this from Kate Spade. They have this on sale. Um, now I think they're having their 75% off sale. You can get the Wellesley um, Travel Wallet. This is a travel wallet. And I put this cute little embellishment here on it. And I originally had the mini classic happy planner inside of here, which it will fit, but it was kind of tight. The mini classic planner does fit in this one as well but um, you do have to take out the gold rings that are in here and put it in there. And then it's kind of like a very snug fit around the corners there. It is a snug fit. My planner did not come like this. I did this when I was cleaning, <laughs> cleaning it. So I'm probably gonna have to put something over it to kind of cover that up. But um, I am going to show you what I have done with this little baby, and I'm super, super excited. So I decided that I want to use this one as my planner. Well, not as a as an on-the-go type of wallet. I really want to use it as that. Um, and then still have my planner and some little quick little things to go with it, just because it's black. The pink one, you know, I carry it now. It's summer or whatever, but, you know, sometimes I do like to just have something that's like a basic color. You can go in any purse. You know, you pull it out, no problem. This black won't get as dirty as easily as the pink one because I really want to use this all the time. So this is what I have done. I have purchased from the Happy Planner a Skinny Mini. So this is a skinny mini, just to kind of give you an idea of how a uh, classic, the, the regular size Happy Planner mini would have fit. It fit like right here perfectly. It fit in here perfectly. It was just what, it didn't really close good like I wanted it to in here or anything. And I was just like, oh, I don't know what to do. Now, I do have all these different little embellishments and everything here, but I'll show you really quickly. It has a lot of pockets for you to put your um, credit cards or whatever here, which is what I do plan on doing. I just, you know, kind of like dressed it up uh, for us here for me today. 
to kind of show you guys, but I am going to be putting my um, go-to cards here. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get it back in on this video, but that's fine. I wanted to show you guys how it works anyway. There's also a pocket here for you to stick things in. It's very deep. So I guess I'll just be taking everything out to show, <laughs> to show you guys. And then there's this zip, which is also great that, oh, I guess I do have some stuff in there already. I got some coins in there, whatever, and some receipts from when I was using it, this receipt. So yeah, so as you can see, it does. It did have a pin loop here. I had to take the pin loop out because when I was trying to fit it for the, um, for the uh, skinny, uh, the, the regular mini happy planner, it wouldn't fit good. So I needed to tear that out. So now I now that I'm using the skinny mini, the pin loop would have still worked out good. So you you know, I just slid in the back part there, and then it's the same thing on this side. You have this pocket here, and you have the zip and everything, and then you have all of these nice little things. Now, this is originally for like a passport type deal, um, but um, and you know, so you can slide your passport in here and then use it while you're traveling and have all of your important documentation and information and everything um, in there, which, you know, you can, you know, you can always, you know, still do that if that's what you want to do. But for me, I have used, I'm going to be using it for my skinny, um, I'm using the skinny mini as my actual wallet to kind of like make sure my life is always in order and organized. I have found that with planning, it helps me to stay on track and organized. <laughs> I'm still gonna have my personal size planner um, with things, but for this skinny mini, it's gonna be more like just bullet points of things that I just need to make sure I quickly reference while I'm on the go. I actually um, stay tuned for a next video because I am going to make some um, DIY cash envelopes that I'll be using to put in here um, and a few other little ideas that I kind of came up with to really make this a nice functional little wallet. So I'll just, this side is really gonna be the side that's gonna be decorative, but on this side here is where I'll have my, put all my, my um, credit cards and things. So to give you an idea of how things would look, if you do decide to purchase this and get it, um, this pocket here is very deep. And I just had this stuck with some double-sided tape because I like to remove and change things. So I may not always keep that sticker there. So this is very deep here. And this one is short, 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 you know, short for credit cards, short. And then this goes all, this goes kind of down to about right here. So if you had some longer papers or anything you wanted to put here, there, and this one goes all the way down to here. <laughs> so you have two really long pockets, but then the rest you have short pockets. So then I would just have my, oh. so this is how you would have your cards. Now I bought a huge pack of these from Amazon, these black little um, things, uh, just to like always protect my cards and stuff, especially if I do videos and stuff. So it still looks quite nice like this. So I can still, if I wanted to leave my little, you know, leave my little embellishments just like that. If that's, you know, kind of, oh, this one is a short one. So I can, I could start it here. So you'll see, you know, how many cards. And these are just, these are my major, these cards are the major cards that I use uh, on a daily basis. These are my major cards here. So, you know, I can always still use that and still have them in, still have a little bit of decoration on this side, still quickly access my cards, still quickly access, you know, cash, uh, whatever I need, important paper, stick my receipts in there and be on my way. So this is super cute. I've done my first little, uh, I'll do a quick flip through of the skinny mini just in case you guys have never seen it. It's very, very small pages as you can see. So uh, when you open it up, you get your 
dashboard and then you get this little page here just important to do's and like i said i just want it to be quick like little bullet points i love this page where you can just write things here so like when i'm on the go i take my kids to the dentist or whatever if you know their next dentist appointment i can just go ahead and put it right on in there and flip you know flip through the month and put it right on in there so that's what i like about it um, the most. So this is the first spread that I've done and I think it's super duper cute um, that I've done here. It's actually this week's uh, spread. So I'm going to go ahead and fill it out with just little important bullet points of things that I need to do, need to know right away. And just, yeah, this is just what I'm going to be using this for. So I really, really like it. Um, I put as a quick tip, this is a paper clip that will let you know, like, you know, you can easily fit through your day. I didn't, it's too long. If you have paper clips that you want to use and you have like a zipper on or something and it's too long that way, just try it this way. And you can still easily go and flip to it. There's, I'm not going to create any dashboards or anything like that. I just would rather use a little paper clip, something that sticks out that'll get me right to where I need to do. I did a little decorating and put, you know, a little quote card here with some washi tape and everything here. But just in case you can't find one of these babies and you really, really wanted one and you can't find one, um, you can and you have a skinny mini um or you use a cash envelope system where you have the happy planner rings on there um and you just want something nice and durable that will last um definitely check out the kate spade travel wallet um and i think it's called a large travel wallet and i'll try to put a link to it um in the description box and there you go and you have a nice good durable leather wallet that you can just take with you and just pull out quickly you see how it unzips so easily and you have bam your cards and everything right there ready for you to use so thank you guys for watching this video i hope this has inspired you or given you some tips or an ideas of how you can personalize a wallet for yourself thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one